we're taking a look at the settings app today. This little icon right here, tap. And we have several different kinds of settings. So uh, airplane mode, we can take off Wi-Fi if you're in an airplane. On, right? You notice Wi-Fi disappeared. Okay, so I'll take that off. Take that off. Now it's connected again. So we have our Wi-Fi, we know it's going, and we know what network we're connected to. Uh, notifications and location services, and it's pretty useful to in have these settings be on because, for instance, the Maps app can uh, search from your current location and it can give you directions uh, based on where you are right now. Brightness and wallpaper. I don't know why those two things are combined in the current iPad OS, but Auto brightness, if it's on, that means that it dims automatically under ideal lighting conditions and that helps to uh, conserve battery power and make it last longer. So you can adjust it here as well. Very bright, not bright at all. Okay, so the brightness is adjusted inside the settings app and the wallpaper over here, we can give it a different wallpaper. We can go through the wallpapers that are supplied or go through your camera roll and put your own picture uh, in the background of your app. So I'll just pick something random. Uh, let's pick these. Let's pick this icon right here. So you can do set lock screen, set home screen, or set both. And I'll do set both. And let's temporarily leave the settings app so I can show you. There it is, new image on my iPad. Okay, back to settings. Now, uh, picture frame, if you have a bunch of pictures in your photos app, I need to turn this off temporarily. So uh, before unlocking it, there's a little picture of a daisy right here. If you click on that, then it, it turns your iPad into uh, a digital picture frame. Anyway, it's showing your pictures uh, in a little slideshow, uh, just like a digital picture frame would. Back to settings. So we got the picture frame, and you can have settings, you know, what kind of transition, how long does each last, what kind of albums or groups are going to be selected for that. So that's all controlled inside of settings. And then there's general settings, and you can look through those. You can do a uh, pass, uh, passcode lock, so you can control general settings over here. Then we have mail contacts and calendars, and this is where you put your uh, settings for each of your uh, email addresses so that the Apple Mail app can bring in your, your mail. Safari, settings about Safari. iPod. Videos, photos, FaceTime, and you can see over here there are settings for individual apps as well, some of them. So you'll find all of that stuff in your settings, and the thing that you'll use the most, again, is that brightness. You'll want to adjust the brightness, like if you're reading in bed, you're going to want it a lot less bright than it normally is. So all of the settings, appropriately, we find inside the Settings app.